Hello and welcome to a new video for StabbyCAD for Revit. Today I would like to show you StabbyCAD's comprehensive cable routing tool, which allows electrical design professionals to quickly and accurately route circuits within 3D Revit models. This system was created by placing electrical equipment using the StabbyCAD content families and the StabbyCAD containments. So first of all, I go to project settings and I'm going to reduce the spare capacity from 25 to 20. This setting defines both the required spare capacity and weight of the ducts for this project. I leave the rest of the settings, including annotation tag, routing permissions, priorities and optimizations as they are for this example. I go into the system browser for my model here which contains all details of the tray and board components and I select the sub-main cabling between the boards and the final loads. Using the StabbyCAD tool Show Routes, you can see the current routes of the sub-main cables. Those of you who have experience with standard Revit will be familiar with this site. Cables that run independently of containment by the shortest route through open space. Now I will show you StabbyCAD's auto routing tool. I select these cables again in the system browser and click on auto route. StabbyCAD then analyzes the optimum route through the submain containment. 16 circuits have been successfully routed in under a minute. They're listed here and can even be viewed within the model individually by selecting the corresponding find buttons. To show them all within the model, however, I select Show Route again up here. Using StabbyCAD's auto routing tool, I have quickly and accurately routed cables through the containment. Up the high riser to these boards at the top of the building and through the system. There is also the option to auto route by selection and manual route, depending on the level of control required. It is also possible to see details of all circuits running through a section of containment and detailed cable data simply by selecting it and then clicking on edit containment and then circuits. Furthermore, by selecting a particular cable and clicking on edit circuit, I can show you detailed component data and using the find buttons, follow the exact route of the cable as it has been accurately auto-routed by StabbyCAD through each section of containment. Thank you for watching and see you next time. To request a demo or learn more about Trimble MEP products, visit us at mep.trimble.com or find the right link for you in the description.